will cost 5 million euros to Real Madrid. New fullback is coming to the club. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Fabrizio Romano here as always to keep you posted on the transfer market. And today guys, we touch on a new signing for Real Madrid for the next season, but also touching on Cristiano Ronaldo Truth and also on Evan Ndika, the center back who is gonna leave Eintracht Frankfurt on a free. Let's jump into it together. And guys, we can say that Real Madrid have already signed their first player for the next season, 2023-2024, because the agreement is completed with Rayo Vallecano for Fran Garcia, this left back born in uh, 1999, so a player who already knows very well Real Madrid, was in Real Madrid yacht team, then they decided to sell the player to Rayo Vallecano, but with a 50 per cent uh, close, uh, sell-on close to keep the player uh, rights in the future. And so what happens? That Real Madrid have now full agreement with Rayo Vallecano, have already prepared the documents for this deal after the verbal agreement in January. And so Fran Garcia will be Real Madrid player next season. What's the process? Real Madrid will officially trigger the close for 10 uh, million euros for Fran Garcia, but as they had a 50% sell-on close in the deal, they will only pay half of the fee. So the Fran Garcia deal will cost 5 million euros to Real Madrid. New fullback is coming to the club. The player has already agreed a five-year deal with Real Madrid. So everything is done between Fran Garcia and Real Madrid and between Real Madrid and Rayo Vallecano. They are now preparing the documents, but we can confirm what was already in the air in January. Fran Garcia will be a Real Madrid player. Why? Because an Italian club and a German club, that is Bayer Leverkusen, tried to sign Fran Garcia in January. So Real Madrid decided to move fast on that one to keep the player at the club and this is why the expectation is to see Frank Garcia as part of the first team next season after this investment for the fullback to return at Real Madrid. So the deal is almost done and we can say a big here we go for Real Madrid. Also important to touch on Cristiano Ronaldo because uh, we had some uh, stories we know in uh, December, in November about Cristiano Ronaldo returning to Real Madrid. Something I wanted to clarify is that internally in Real Madrid they were very clear in November, in December, they were never thinking of return on Cristiano Ronaldo despite some rumors we had in that moment. Something I wanted to clarify is that Real Madrid keep an excellent relationship with Cristiano Ronaldo. It's about Carlo Ancelotti, Florentino Perez, all the people into the club, but Cristiano was never close to returning to Real Madrid. Uh, he was just training, but never with the squad in uh, December to keep his uh, condition at the best level, but he was never close to returning to Real Madrid, and it was never in the club's plan. With all the respect to Cristiano Ronaldo, his return was not uh, contemplated in November and December, and this is something that they are not even thinking for the future uh, as a player, of course. So this is the situation around Ronaldo, and Real Madrid love Ronaldo, Ronaldo loves Real Madrid, but he's under percent focused on Al Nasser now and this is important uh, to say also on Evan Ndika guys this center back uh, who is playing in Bundesliga for uh, Eintracht Frankfurt uh, he didn't extend uh, the contract with uh, uh, Eintracht and the expectation is for him to leave on a free contract at the end of the season What's going on? We had reports of uh, an agreement between Barcelona and Dica on a free transfer, but at the moment, from what I'm told, at the moment, uh, sources deny this agreement. They say there is, at the moment, nothing agreed between Dica and Barcelona. Barcelona are among many clubs tra tra tracking the player, following the player in Italy, in England, in Germany and in Spain. So it's a big opportunity to have Dica on the free, and this is why many clubs are following him, including Barca, but they never had any agreement in place. So at the moment, the situation remains open for Dika. They're following the player, but it's not a done deal. So let's see how it will end up for this center back, but one to follow in the next weeks and months. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on Fran Garcia to Real Madrid, Ndika situation, big free agent. I want your opinion in the comments. Also Cristiano Ronaldo. And guys, as always, remember to subscribe to the channel, like this video, turn on the notification bell. Story every day here on the channel. See you soon with Fabrizio. Ciao.